Listen up, because we're going to show you how to become a better investor. This is the Billion Dollar Startup Series. Your host, The Angel King. So there are five that I absolutely love for varying reasons, but these you've got to get started with these to get a better sense of what the, the experts are talking about in angel investing and venture capital. Uh, the first on my list is David Rose's book, Angel Investing. Uh, it's, it's such a thorough read. It gives you a, a general concept of not just uh, what startups are the hottest in the industry, but the, the numbers behind them, sort of the back end analysis of what a term sheet looks like. Um, and what you need to be aware of, what sort of returns uh, take place, the IRRs of angel investing. The second book I absolutely love is by, uh, it's by Brad Feld and Jacob Mendelson, and it's called Venture Deals. It's a great book. Uh, Venture Deals is a great book because it provides you uh, insight from two perspectives. So from the startup's perspective, giving an overview of the startup world, uh, which the Foundry Group, which is uh, what Brad Feld is part of, um, the startups they've seen and what sort of success they've seen, as well as the term sheet. What are the numbers behind the terms that as an investor you need to be aware of? Um, that's my second favorite book. Um, the third book is a book, and it's not considered as much of a startup book, but I think investors need to be aware of. It's called Built to Sell, uh, John Warlow. Uh, he wrote a book called Built to Sell, and Built to Sell is kind of cool because many now startup founders may have actually taken this path. In the book, he details how a, a typical service-based company became a product and was then able to sell a product and then sell the company itself. And Built to Sell should be the foundation of any venture capitalist uh, reading list. The fourth book I absolutely love, and I've just read it recently, is called by Peter Thiel, founder of PayPal, Palantir Technologies. Uh, many other uh, great companies, the first investor in Facebook, and Peter Thiel wrote Zero to One. Um, and he tackles many of the non-traditional aspects of investing. Um, he, it's a series that's taken from lectures he did at Stanford University, written with his teaching assistant. Um, and it's got a nice perspective on how investing isn't just about the quote unquote lean startup, but there's many other aspects to creating your own monopoly and therefore a successful company. And the fifth, of course, on my list is our own Kings Over Aces, which I wrote. And part of the reason I wrote the book was because I felt like there was not this nuanced version of the true, tremendously analytic side on one hand of startups, term sheet, numbers, data, anal uh, analytics, uh, and it's sort of where was the middle ground where you could not just learn as an investor what companies to look out for, but also some of the numbers too. So all five of those books, David Rose, Brad Feld, John Warlow with Built to Sell, all the way to our own Zero to One are good foundations. And I think education and reading is important. Sometimes going to, the event as well, uh, going to events is important too, where you can meet founders and startups. But I hope those five are, are, are on your reading list too. If you've got more questions, visit angelkings.com.